Hey guys, this is Nidhi. Welcome back to my channel, Nidhi's World. So today we will be making a very special recipe. I've been drinking this since childhood. It is very healthy. You know, the Boost Horlicks aren't healthy. So this is a substitute, but it is also very tasty and easy to make. And it is our homemade Dreyfus powder. It still has a lot of us uses. You can use it in dishes and desserts. I'll tell you in which you can use it in the last. So hang on until there. Let's get into the recipe. So here we have all our ingredients. 2 cups of badam, 1 cup of cashew. We have half cup of pistachios, half cup of walnuts, 1 cup of crystallized sugar. It is as per your sweetness. If you like it to be more sweeter, you can add more. If you like it to be less sweeter, you can reduce it. We have kesari which smells so good and nutmeg. We are going to use only half of this nutmeg. This is just for the flavors. So here we have 20 grams of cardamom and this also smells really good and it is also for the flavors. So this is we have turmeric. We have one full spoon of turmeric and here we have milk powder. So this is also known as a coffee whitener. We use this to combine all of this as you know the nuts release oil to make sure they don't become sticky we add this and you can add it as per your wish you can add more or less. So now here I have a thick base vessel I have put it on low heat we have to fry the badam in low heat. This process to fry all of the dry fruits will take about 15 to 20 minutes. And in the second vessel, I'll add the cashew. So now I will fry these and a reminder, you have to fly, uh, fry them in low heat. So now the cashew is fried, we have to let it cool until it is in room temperature. I'll put it here so it can cool quicker. Now I'll add the pistachio and fry these two. In the same way, after the pistachios are roasted, we have to roast our walnut and our badam also and let it cool so it comes to room temperature so we can move on to the next process so now i have fried all my dry fruits in meanwhile while it's cooling down let us make a powder of the crystallized sugar and the cardamom first i'll add the sugar then the cardamom In Kannada, we call this as Kalsakre, which is literally translating to rock sugar. So this is better than the normal sugar. Now I'll add the nutmeg. I have made a coarse powder of it. Please remember only half of the nutmeg is needed in our recipe. Now I will close it. To sieve the mixture so there are no crystals left in it, crystals or big chunks. And we also do this process to remove the skin of the cardamom. You can look at how fine and smooth this powder is. It looks so good. Now you can see all this is left back. So I'll add this into the grinder again and again make a powder out of it. You can 
add this to the tea powder and mix it in to give a nice cardamom smell and flavor also. Now in the pesto and mortal, I'll add the kesari and roughly grind it. This smells like heaven. Now I'll add it into the sugar crystal powder. Look at that color. Now I'll add the turmeric. It is for the color and even there are good uses like it gives immunity power. Now my dry fruits have come into room temperature. I will grind them. It won't become into a powder at once. So you have to grind them in intervals so that they don't release oil and become into a nice powder. So first I'll mix all the dry fruits so it's evenly distributed. So now I'll add little by little into the grinder. Now the powder has turned out like this. I will add it to the mixture we made earlier. I will make the rest of the dry fruits into a powder like this. And see you when I complete making that and we will move on to the next procedure. Now I'll add the milk powder and mix it. Oh, so soft. Mix, mix, mix. Now I'll take a little bit of the powder, crush it once again so it turns even finer. I'll do the same to the rest of the powder. I'll do the same to the rest of the powder. So after grinding it, the powder looks like this. So I've put it into the glass jar. You should keep this away from moisture and wet hands. Now let's have a try. I'll add one spoon of the powder we made. You can also chill the milk. It's as per your wish. If you leave it like this for 2 minutes, you can start seeing yellow color. It will come from the turmeric and the saffron. You can also garnish it with a little bit of saffron, badam flakes and pistachios on the top just to make it look pretty. You can see I left it for 2 minutes and the color has come. I have garnished it with a little bit of saffron and it looks so good. Let's try it. Cheers! It is really good and, and this is the summer season. I will drink chilled once every day. It would be so good during in the sun and you can use this powder even in keys and paisa or any dessert you want and adding a spoon to the North Indian curries also gives it a very good taste. 
Even when you add it into fruit salads, the flavor it gives would be so delicious. So we've come to the end of today's video. This is it for today's video. If you do like my video, please do like, share and subscribe to my channel. And see you all next time. Goodbye and let me enjoy my beverage.